Good morning, Steve. Uh, good to catch up again. So Steve runs uh, Equifilter up in uh, Walkwith. So it's Equifilter Rodney, if I get the name correct. Correct. Um, Steve, you've been uh, part of the big program in one-on-one coaching for about two years, two and a half years. So it'd be good to get some feedback from you, what you have experienced in the journey, uh, where you've come from, and where you feel that you're heading. Yeah, thanks, Sean. Um, yeah, I switched coaches, as Sean said, about two and a half years ago. Um, and, yeah, I haven't really looked back since. At that time, um, the business was growing. It's always growing. Um, but we were at a difficult growth stage. Um, and things weren't quite right, mostly around the financials um, and um, some of the way that we were doing things. And so um, what I liked about Sean was that... Um, what I like about you, Sean, is that um, you offer a unique uh, package where we get to have, it's a structured environment, but yet there's room to, um, you know, so the structured environment I need personally uh, to help me focus on the financials and the 90 day planning. It's something that I wouldn't do on my own. Um, and so having uh, Sean around to draw attention to that and then being part of the big group that Sean's got going where, you know, you're, it's not like you're accountable to the other business owners in the room, but you kind of are um, because you're sharing what you're doing, what you're up to, what your wins are and what your challenges are. And so um, it's a good way or it's a healthy way um, of paying attention to the numbers, the right numbers um, and the 90 day goal planning. Um, which, as I say, left to my own devices, you know, there's so many other things going on in the business that that always seems to get put on the back burner. And so what I like is that um, it doesn't matter what's going on, there's this constant, um, I'm constantly being drawn my attention back to the 90-day plan and, and, you know, what's bigger than that. And so for me, that's, that's quite important and, and essential, really. And I've seen the growth uh, in the business over the last two years from having that attention paid to the right areas consistently. Yeah. Um, and that's the key. So it's, there's, no, there's no quick fixes or anything, but it's um, it's getting that consistent growth um, and having someone alongside that's um, drawing your attention to the right things at the right time. Good. Um, and, and it's profitable growth. Exactly, yeah, and it's profitable growth. So last year we, we had a good profit uh, for the first time in a long time, uh, which was, uh, very exciting um, and it's allowing us to continue to grow and leverage a bit more this year um, which has been really good good have you been able to observe any changes in your motivation or enthusiasm to pitch up to work that's a good question i think a yes is a short answer i think um definitely having a plan on paper uh, even you know, like a, a one year plan, like this, uh, the soap that we do, and then the 90 day. Um, you know, there's things in process, and you know, you might not look at it every day, but, um, but knowing that there is a plan there and that you're following it and that it's working, um, you can draw a lot of confidence from that. Um, and, you know, it allows you to cope with what else is going on and, and all the daily, the daily interruptions and all the rest of it. Um, much easier um, knowing that there's a plan in place and knowing where it's going to take you. So, good. Yeah. Good. Excellent. So, Steve's just got back from one week of, of holiday, which has uh, always been something quite difficult for him to get away from, from work. So, Steve, let's jump into the rest of today's program. <laughs>